The New York Yankees Al struck out 17 times. Yeah. The Astros struck out two. That is the biggest strikeout differential uh, between two teams in postseason wow. history. And the Yankees had chances early against Verlander, but then after that, he really got locked in. Yes, and uh, I, I think what, what – and Justin alluded to it in, the, in his post game about eventually he got a feel for the breaking ball. And I think early on, watching that game, first or second inning, right? He, he I, I didn't in, think he had it early, right? Kind of like Darvish the other night in game one. And then all of a sudden – Yeah. So I'll, wait here, but, but do it, on that. Do it. But it's confidence. It's rolling. For a guy who's got 244 career – Big league wins. Hall of Famer, future Hall of Famer. Wants to play till he's 45 years old. When you come off a game where you know the feel wasn't right, and I think he talked about having to get a feel for his breaking ball. Slider curveball combination still uses, uh, you know, three pitch mix with his changeup. The first inning is always a feel. I don't care if you're a Hall of Famer. I don't care if you're a 4A player. You got it. Get the feel for spinning the baseball. The guy throws 97 miles an hour. His heater is every bit is as good as it was. Maybe first couple years with Detroit where he touched some hundreds. But this was awesome. When you had the two breaking balls at, that, that he really possessed, and, and talking about it uh, yesterday with uh, Nola um, having sliders and curveballs, that's the difference. And then you get a guy like that roll, it, it's just. Al, he mentioned something Almost in the post game. He mentioned something in the post game, and he said, "I don't want to go too deep in the weeds because yeah. I don't think everyone would understand." Yep. He tweaked his calf huh? late in the season, right? Took some time on the IL, and he said, "I found some things mechanically that that needed adjusting." So it wasn't just familiarity with 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 Seattle, yeah. facing them to seven times in a row, and and yes. and, and, and then. So I, I was wondering, what do you think, like, because. Wainwright mentioned he found something mechanically based off an injury with with his uh, dead arm. Yeah, and he was like, tweeting out different yeah. things. So, so, like, what could a calf extension oh gosh, or no, so but, much? Yeah, no, Dero. Yeah, look, the only way I can relate it to, and I know all you guys as hitters are, are looking at Altuve right now, and he's struggling. Right, he's in between. Put his foot down. Slow down. Yeah, he's start just sped early. up. He's trying to hit it. Out I mean, of that's it. exactly what we want to do, right? Yeah. We want to press on the gas pedal, press on the brake. Press. That's what we're doing. We're trying to find where you are. Oh, he's late. He's late. He's late. Okay. Oh, he's on it. I got to get him out front. Your body as a pitcher, from your Feet, ankles, calf, quads, hamstrings, midsection, right on up to when the ball leaves your hand. All of it works. It's yeah. a kinetic chain. So when you have some sort of weakness, you you kind of try to find Compensate you, it. you try to find your place. You mm. try to find the spot where it doesn't hurt as much. And maybe I won't push off as much. And maybe I don't get quite the same finish. Yeah. It it's from ankle to to soon as the ball leaves your hand. And real quick, I thought Brian Anderson had a great comment last night because we I, I like to focus on where a guy stands on the mound. Yeah. Is he on third base side, yeah. first base side? Did you hear? Him? I did hear that. He's like, it's my mound. He controls. He, the he does. Yeah. I mean, he's sliding across it. Yeah. He's out. <laughs> bang! He'll, yeah. he'll take his cleat and wipe it off. Me, uh, yeah. Which you know, that. I've talked about that with the utilizing the 24-inch pitcher's rubber and where you are. And if you're consistently missing on one spot. Yeah. Use it. Yeah. And he's right in the middle. Golly.